Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Ty the Tasmanian Tiger. In the last episode, we got all 25 rainbow scales and by, uh, oh yeah, let me just change my options because I had the sound up for getting the, there we go, that's, leave it, about there, and we'll have the music about there, so let's level them out, there we go. Well yes, I had the sound up to get all of the picture cards because people did say on Twitter and Skype and such, it's really tedious to get them all, and yeah, it was really tedious if we do this, but we got 9, 7, 6, 9, 20, 24, 5, 29, and 18. That took me about three hours, so I can see why quite a few of my friends and watchers said that it wouldn't be a good idea to show where all those picture cards are. However, if you look at the bottom, we've only got 127 out of 373. So you can probably guess where the rest of them are. That is in Cass's Pass. Now this is split into three levels. Cass Pass, Cass Crest, which will appear here, and Boss Cass. So what I'm probably going to do is I'm going to run through Cass's Pass and Cass's Crest normally, then save it before Boss Cass, then go back through them and get the pitch frames off screen just before Boss Cass. But for now, let's head into Cass Pass and I'll be quiet for the course. Did you take care of our little problem? I tried, but um, he's stronger than I thought. He's stronger than you thought. Friends, the Bunyips are helping him. What? <laughs> then the stakes have been raised. To take over the wild, I must have those talismans. I need them to open the portal to the dream time so I can banish all those annoying warm-blooded mammals once and for all. Present company accepted, of course. Well, if our orange friend is so intent on finding the talismans, then I say... Let him. My metal menace here will take care of him and steal back the talismans to boot. <laughs> it's so simple, it's brilliant. <laughs> no one has ever come back from this inhospitable place, so tread carefully. Done all that bad. Now let's have a look. Oh no, Cass's Pass doesn't have any of the picture cars. I guess they're just in Cass's Crest, which is basically like his lair. This is just a road to his lair. So uh, if there's no picture cars to worry about, then I've got nothing to worry about in using this. Oh, you poor pathetic fools. Well. I mean, I guess he's right, no one else, has, no one's ever made it back. <laughs> Neither will the lizards, or anything else that's working with boss cast. Because they're just going to be like, oh, hello, oh, I'm dead. Because I've got the kaboomerang. Oh yes, how does it feel? Thank you for showing me them spikes, how does it feel, ninja lizards? This is, this is what I love about, like, old games when they're just like, you know what, dude? We're right at the end. I mean, Boss Cass himself does actually have, like, uh, armor, so he's not affected by the boomerangs. but all the little minions, you know, you don't want to waste time on these minions anymore. It's like, they're below you, and this is what I love about all the old games, and even the new Ratchet and Clank just grants at you, where it's like, hey, You've dealt with all the shitty minions, but you're at the end of the game. You don't want to deal with the shitty minions anymore. You don't, you don't need to deal with those guys. Don't worry about it. Here's just the ultimate weapon that'll just annihilate them so you can just get to boss cast. You know, actual, actual enemies that are going to pose a threat. I mean, if you notice, boss cast had uh, new frills, which were in those biohazard rubber suits. So they are a little bit more special than your regular frill lizards. 
So yeah, it's just like, you know, you don't need to deal with the regular ninjas or the regular frills and the ninja lizards. They're below you now. Let's just move on to the to the biohazard suit lizards, which are a lot more special. Just it is it is the kaboomerang. Just go go nuts, mate. And it's like, oh don't worry, I intend to. Like uh, apparently we have landed in the water. So we can't explode the crocodiles. So they should be grateful. Don't even bite me. I will do it. Do not do not hold me to to any kind of challenge. I have I have Ripperoos. I have the power to destroy you, crocodile. Do not do it. I also like the music in this level. It's, it does like have that adventurous. It's really building up to the the final moment type vibe. Uh, is this going to go back at the correct time? I hope so, because these are way out of sync. Like really out of sync. Okay, yeah, we do get ah no, it's going away. It's going away. We just managed to grab onto that. So we'll just go to the left. And on we go. Yep, here comes the here comes the special here comes the special dudes with that little sniper rifle. So let's run through the fire. You get out of here. You get out of here. All three of them. Lovely. And you get out of here. Whoa, did you see that? Like when we get a little bit of slowdown. Like, um, can we can we get that again? Like when we get a bit of slowdown or it gets really far away, it seems like yeah. Look, it's got like little squares around it. Like it's not properly rendered. <laughs> that's kind. Of, that's kind of funny. That's fine though. That's fine. Right. So we are just gonna jump over these, and I believe like this is the end of Cass Pass. Like Cass's Pass, the road itself. Where are we going? I'm gonna go over this side. The road itself is quite sure. Oh, we've lost our double double damage or double HP. But the road itself is kind of sure, especially when you've got the Kaboomerang. Like, there's really only this um, jumpy bit left. Like, yeah, you can see the portal. If I just get rid of these ninjas, excuse me, I stop running around. But yeah, if we just uh, get rid of these ninjas here, you can see that the portal is just over there. And you know what? Why the hell even bother biting it? Because Let's face it. We know these crocodiles can't like catch up to us, so we're just gonna we're just gonna jump around the edge, ignore all this nonsense because we can just ignore all this nonsense. So we can just like take a nice quick run around the edge, and that will be Cass's pass done, and we'll be moving into Cass's crest. So around we go, around we go. I wonder if the developers actually realise that you can just do this, like. Oh, by the way, all of those um, spy egg bitey puzzles, yeah, I don't need to do them. You just kind of run around the edge and be like, this is it. Time. This is it. About to enter boss Cass's lair. There's a lot of strife ahead, so do your fair dinkum best to make it through in one piece, okay, Di? No worries. What's the matter, Mori? Sorry, babe. I've just got something in my eye, that's all. <laughs> She'll be right, mate. She'll be right. Good luck, Ty. Good luck. <laughs> I don't think I need luck, Mr. Oh, well. <laughs> I don't think I need luck, Mr. Parrot. I've got something better than luck. I've got the power of explosions. <laughs> now, I don't believe we can touch this water because it's lava fight. Actually, can we? Oh, yeah, we can. And you know what? Again. Why bother going through all the strife? Just, uh, okay, well that mine got me. Why bother going through all the strife? Let's just swim our way around. Oh, no, 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 they have actually thought of this one. They have actually thought of this one and we have to go around fairly. Fair enough, fair enough. I'm not going to be annoyed at them for that. You know, we did just cheese the last area, so fair play. Wait a minute. Absolutely, where are we going here? Well, there's some pie. Get rid of you. Uh, wait a second. Where are we going? Oh, I see the hole now. I see the hole. Don't explode. Oh, the door's locked. Oh no. Have I got to find a switch? Have they got smarter? That door's locked. Give me the extra life, though. Um, 
I can't jump up onto any of this. Ah, there, no, that's, that's still what? Oh, no, ah, oh, there's the stairs, all right, we found it. We found it. Don't know why that didn't explode, but whatever. Let's just run past them again. It's the end. Oh, hello. Of course. Hi, Bat Lady. Hi, Rouge. Rouge's deformed sister. Even though, like, Boss Cast literally just said, let him have all the talismans so that he can just take all five at once, but whatever. You know? Right, let's get rid of all of these. Excuse me. Now, I've got no idea what she's doing with these bats. Oh, apparently they can attack me. Can I just throw these at her? Just deal with it? Nope. So they have, I'll be honest, I will actually be real honest on, on you with this, they have actually... Uh, okay. I'll be honest, they have actually sorted out the bosses, because in the original PlayStation 2 version, you could literally just throw the exploding boomerang and... It couldn't be stopped whatsoever, like, it was that broken and overpowered that no matter what, it just couldn't be stopped. Like, even her bats couldn't defend her. It just blew up in her face, and it's like, hey, blew up in your face, now you're dead. But now they've actually, um, they've actually fixed it. They've actually programmed it so that you have to find the switch and solve the puzzle. Which I, I appreciate, at least they're actually making sure the bosses can't just be absolutely annihilated. Minions, yeah, the minions are fine. You've already dealt with these guys for the entire game. These guys don't, don't mean crap anymore. We don't need to worry about these guys. But the bosses, at least they've actually, like, fixed the bosses now. And we really don't need that extra life, so... We'll just keep trundling on through the lava, the lava waterfalls here. Up there, the fire. And now we'll just throw this, get rid of that frill that's on the other side waiting for us. And then glide over and deal with that lady. I what? I did not make that. Go on. God, it's so stretched. Ty, always gonna, gonna give me some stretch jumping. I, I don't know how you do these bats either. Like, I was, I was throwing boomerangs at them to make them explode, but... Apparently not. Apparently I just can't grab this, even though you can clearly see me grabbing it. Alright. I guess we'll go around that way then? I mean, we shouldn't have to, but... I guess we will? No, we can't even... Can we... That seems further than the other one to me. That's not further than the other one. This seems incredibly stretched. That is incredibly stretched. So... Where do you want me to go? I think what they really need to do is just improve the hitboxes, because half the time, I feel like, like that, I'm grabbing onto it and it only barely grabs on for whatever reason. Sometimes it doesn't at all. Well, I guess we'll get this extra life now since we're here. There we go, we did- We didn't even lose a life, except, uh, we can't get back. So I guess we're going back around the full way. Why did I do this? Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I mean, we're coming up to 15 minutes, so we'll beat Bat Lady and then we'll save the finale for next time of Boss Chess. So let's get rid of this is Bat Lady. Excuse me. Excuse me. What is going on? I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Alright. We're not stuck anymore. Okay. So, I think I might just take a speed up for two seconds here. So, I'm not going to cut, I'm just going to put it on like times 400 speed while I get back to it because we've got to do all the puzzles again. Uh, 
Uh, okay, well, the stop for a second there, but all right. All right. Get rid of that. That's going to create some steam. And we're just going to explode you. Explode you. Keep throwing them. Yep, there we go. We're going to get her sooner or later. And then she's going to go over here. Do we have to balance beam along these pipes? Nope. How do I... Where's she flying off to? Over there. Right. And then we're going to do this. And then we're going to chase her. You're going to launch me correctly. Right, excuse me. Excuse me. I'm pretty sure I hit that switch. Uh, oh, well, we'll use the zoom around now. There we go. Don't know why that didn't work correctly. Uh, don't, don't try it. Don't try it. You must all die from the giant explosion. Because I like to see the explosions. And all of you will be gone. And this should be her final hit. So where's the switch? Finish her off. Just watch out for that. You know what? We can't just go around the edge. But where is the switch to finish her off? Switch is up there. She's gonna throw some bats. Yeah, throw your bats at me. I don't care. The, the final switch has been hit, and that is going to release the vent to, to throw the boomerangs at her. And you are dead. You shouldn't even be here anyway. Don't, don't, don't thank me. You shouldn't even be here anyway. Ridiculous, ridiculous woman. Right, anyway, boy, enough of that. And I believe there's a secret. If you, uh, if you zoom around and you take the vent rather than the thing, yeah, that goes up there. Oh wait, is the secret downwards then? Oh yeah, it's just an extra life. I thought I thought there was an extra life somewhere, but I was like, oh you know what, let's let's have a look at the the true secret. Right. Back to the kaboomerangs. Oh, I hate this. I hate this wall because it like never stops correctly, but we're through! And now we are pretty much at the end. There's just like a load of lizards here, which again, nothing to worry about. And in the next episode, we will be taking on Boss Cass, because as you can see, through that door is the end. Hello. Well, I guess we're going to fight him to end the episode. We'll use the kaboom around, it'll just blow him up. What? What are you doing? I'm giving you a hand, mate. Let go of me. I... you... you're going to regret this. Well, I mean, letting go might not have been a wise idea for you. Anyway... Is this the end? I believe this is the final boss now. Yes, final battle! So we will... Also, that was really nice that you actually just put me... You spawned me in a fire. That was bullshit. But regardless! Regardless! Game info! We have done Cast Pass Cast Crest. So, where are the... Where are all those other pitch cards, I wonder? I guess we'll soon find out. But we will end the episode here, 99% complete. And in the next episode, we shall do the final battle. So thank you all for watching this final build-up to the final battle of Ty. If you did indeed enjoy it, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you don't want to miss out on the final battle, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, 
There is a link to my Patreon in the box below, but for now, thank you for watching, and I'll see all of you in the final battle.